Good evening, YouTube. It's Jeremy X here. And welcome to my first playthrough in my Return to the Past series, where I'll be playing a lot of retro games, mostly because, as you can tell from the intro, there has been an unfortunate tragedy exactly one week ago where my PlayStation memory card's data got wiped due to a ch after a transfer and a save data went horribly wrong. But, I'll admit I was devastated. But this has only made me even more determined to replay them and recomplete them. Because I, like Satori Wada, am a gamer at heart. Anyways, let's get on with 20th Anniversary Pac-Man World. Arguably one of my favorite games for the PlayStation. And my first. Alright, here we go. Oh man, I missed that intro. <laughs> For like late 90s kids, 2000s kids like me, uh, this is just a, so such a treat. I'll admit the graphics have I say they've aged pretty well. I mean, they're not. They're nowhere near as good today, but they're still good. Gosh darn, that dog is adorable. Chomp chomp. I forgot about that part. And that level was fun. Looking back, I don't see why Puka had to be. Things. I mean, sure, he was a big mascot. I mean, sure, he was... Puka's to Dig Dug like what the slimes are to Dragon Quest, but... Why couldn't you get Dig Dug himself? Uh, oh, well. Oh, I love the space levels. This is gonna be fun. And yes, I plan on doing the whole intro. I haven't seen this in... Five years, I think. Oh, actually, seven. Seven years, just like, just like Link. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. First time I saw that, I wet myself. But hey, I was seven. I just gotten this thing. And your little kitty, too! Not like cats. But seriously, why does that cat, like, never show up again? I pity the person who designed that cat. Oh, dear. This time, I've never found out who did that yell. Eh, I guess it's not important. Anyways... Let us get it on. Now that's for the, uh... Sorry, just enjoy the music. That's for the classic Pac-Man arcade game. That's for the main story mode. And this is where you do a bunch of mazes based on the six, you know, themes. And there's two mazes you can get in each game. And then you do this marathon where you can see the art gallery for this, for this, for this game. But enough about that, clever banter. Let's get on. So yeah, poor Pac-Man, that pretty stink. And now is this trash fun. Party on Ghost Island, meet Pac-Man live and in person. To this day, I don't know why they did why they just showered that all over Pac-Man's house. Love this music. This, like, if it wasn't in my PlayStation, this disc was in my CD drive. Here it comes. Oh 
might have been the guy from Pac-Man. BOSS! No, 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 you idiots! I like cold streamers and red balloons! Like DJ Skates, the patties are cooking, and the cake should be chocolate! You're gonna ruin my party! BOSS! What do you want? Pac-Man's here! A ghost island! The Pac-Man! I quoted this game so many times when I was a little kid. I thought you were the real Pac Man. We did see. Oops. Oh, that was a I can't believe that just found all the different colors for all the ghosts. If I had a power to have an error on our part, believe me, it won't happen again. You idiots! My plans are already in motion! Pac-Man cannot be allowed to crash my party! Find him! And destroy him! I'll admit, for what it is, it's gotten a little gnarmy today, but when I was seven, that was some pretty dark stuff. Here we go! Rusty with the deep pad movement. Oh, nice. First time I played that, I fell off. Okay, that was kind of pretty close. Oh man, first time I played through this, I did not play through that particular part. Cause I just didn't, I was not a fan of backtracking in my early days. Yeah, the mat yeah, the hint sign changes from sometimes one blue switch leads to another to Holy crap, look at that! Right at the end. 
Yep. That's everything. Tutorial complete. That was ridiculously easy. Alright, here we go. Sweet, two Galaxians. Peach, peach, cherry. Here we go. Here we go, folks. Cherry. Yes! 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 Never in my original playthrough have I gotten three Galaxians in a row. That was incredible. All right. One percent, not for long. With seven lives, I'm off to a rockin' start. All right, let's just play through this one more level, and that'll be it. But first, I've been wanting to do that for a long time. Okay, so here's Ghost Island. This is like the hub world. Because you can see this is where Pac-Man made landfall. And this is where you can access all the other worlds. Back there was Pirate, here's Ruins. You notice all the other worlds have been walled off. At least all the, all the portals have been walled off because you haven't completed the first one yet. And here's my favorite space. Space Race, Far Out, Gimme Space, and King Galaxia. Unfortunately, you can't go any further than this because there's this wall blocking the way to the later levels. But, that wall's gonna be coming down soon. Mr. Talkman, tear down this wall! Actually, it should be Mr. Iwatani tear down this wall, because, you know, he created Pac-Man. And I hear he had a personal hand in this one, though he did it like they gave him an interview for Pac-Man World 2. Oh, I remember this level so well. Not this time, Buster Brown. Those things will walk around and then just explode on you. Newbies to platformers, even myself included, were sometimes distracted by the two and a half D side score of this. We didn't know where Pac-Man's was and where he started and where he ended. But you just gotta get the hang of it. Sorry if I am making too many comments, I'm just... This game, despite its cute and cuddly appearance, is unbelievably hard down there. Take my word for it. Why this chrome up here, you ask? That's why! That freaking fish! I remember it giving me so many nightmares and migraines and shit as a kid because... When it puffed up, it's... I'm not gonna lie. It scared the bejeebus out of me. And also hurt Pac-Man. 
obviously, but still. Okay, got the P for Pac-Man. Collect the six letters that spells Pac-Man, get to the bonus level. This time, bust around. For this, we gotta move the old-fashioned way. Right, it's triangle to go down, and X to go up. Damn you, muscle man. I have to admit, for 2000, this game was actually pretty revolutionary. I do like busting open barrels, though. Alright, careful. Those things are really spiky. That's why there's all these health wedges around here. I was stuck on that level until I realized you get that the first time. Because I did not want to touch those thorns. Yeah, needless to say, when I was very young in gaming, I was not really smart. But then again, which of us was? Who among us can cast the first stone? Let's all be perfectly honest here. And yeah, if you stay around those things too long, they'll hiss and they'll blow up. You can tell because they get bigger. Oh, you... Potty! Take that, you damn bird. I personally thought Potty was more of a douche than Karen ever was. For those of you who don't know, I'm talking about Spongebob. As if you couldn't guess. Because, you know, we're on the subject of pain. Pretty difficult finding out where everything is. But you just go. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh. Okay, that was. A little too close for comfort. Oh yeah, the Galaxian doors are what contain the mazes. Now, the Galaxians do unlock mazes in later games, but the fruit doors are gone. In Pac-Man World 2, once you eat the Galaxian, they instant maze. Same in, same in Pac-Man World 3, too. Well, sometimes there are maze machines instead of Galaxians. Speaking of which, time for the maze! Sorry, I just like to talk about the controls. Oh, no, you don't. Darn, lost the fruit. 
now notice, despite the fact that red is supposedly rather inky, no, I'm, I'm sorry, it's blinky, but later games misname it as Clyde, I don't know what. Blinky over there is like the fastest and the strongest of the ghosts. But he's not wearing the captain's hat. You know, maybe that may just be because, you know, girl superior or something, but I'll admit, Pinky is just as menacing as Clyde. Perhaps even more so. Faked you out! Yeah, 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 yeah. Baboo! Alright. Back in the drink, back in the drink. Now, back up here. We go up. Eh. Still difficult. Even for veterans like me. Eh, what are you gonna do? Besides that, whoop! Got the bell. Do not make the mistake of jumping on that if you want to get to the bonus level. Now you can do that. The boat, back man. Right now, I gotta wait until it goes all the way back because I had to be a freaking idiot genius. See, sometimes I think I can do this kind of shit, and then when it doesn't work... Um, bad shit happens. Okay, got the key! These items... See, while in the original Pac-Man, they were just... I just mean, hey, you're getting really... You're the ghost are gonna kill you now. In the original Pac-Man, now they're a symbol to say, hey, these keys can help free your friends. Make sure you get them. And then it gives you a nice little home point bonus. Alright, got the crawl. This was one of the biggest perspective. Why you had to do this perspective changes? Because watch this. A baboon. Walk the plank. Invincible finish. Because why not? And that is level two complete. Now then. Here comes the big boy. Bonus level time! Let's see if I'm as good as I hope I am. Oh, 
See how many lives I can get with this one. Cherry. Cherry. Okay, got some bonus points with that. Cherry apple, cherry, cherry. Cherry, cherry, cherry apple, peach, cherry. Cherry, cherry, apple, peach, cherry. Cherry, apple, cherry, peach. So close. Still got plenty of tries. Cherry, apple, cherry, peach. Yeah, that, 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 that. Cherry, apple, peach. Cherry, apple, cherry, stop! That's most people's, like, just total survival. Ooh, so close. Stupid screen lagging. Cherry, peach. Cherry peach cherry. Duh! Stupid lag! Cherry apple cherry peach cherry. Stop! Cherry apple peach cherry. Good. This is good. This is fun. This is a very fun time. Right, just after the Galaxian. After the Galaxian. Damn mosquitoes. Twenty-four lives, baby. All right. With that, I think that's a good place for us to stop. Hope you all enjoyed this video. See you next time. This is Jeremy X, signing off.